Um, I'm making a quick YouTube video because I'm getting frustrated with people. Okay. For starters, people saying shit about me still about being in a psych ward, which was fucking two years ago. Shut up, bro. Which was two years ago. You're still talking. <laughs> still talking shit about it. Like, oh my god, you're fucking crazy, blah, blah, you're psycho. Okay, first off, I wasn't in the psych ward because I was going off mutilating animals and raping and killing people and whatever the fuck people are in there for that you think is so crazy. It's not what you think it is. It's not like the fucking movies, okay? I went there because I was going through a really, really fucking hard time in my life and I needed help. And so I went and got help. Like... I was going through a lot of stuff at home. My girlfriend I was, was with for a year and a half. We broke up. Like, a lot was going on, and I couldn't handle it all. I felt like I was falling apart. I didn't go to school. I couldn't get out of bed. I didn't eat. I couldn't eat. I felt sick to my stomach all the time. I had no appetite. Like, I'm glad I went. Like, if I didn't go, I don't know. I had to go to the hospital. I had to be on medication. Like, a lot of stuff went down. I'm fine now. But people who are fucking sitting there calling me shit because I went to a psych ward for a month. Are you serious? Like, grow the fuck up. You don't understand. Like, I met some pretty chill people there. It's not, you don't, you're not locked in a room. There's no, like, electric chair. Whatever the fuck you think's in there, okay? You go in there. I went to a really nice place in Binghamton. And you each have your individual rooms or whatever. There's, the windows aren't, like, like, they're barred, yeah. But they're not, like, jail barred. They just have, like, little black, it's, like, decorative, like, shit. Um... There's not creepy people walking around. It's nice. You got the staff who's really friendly. We go outside. We get together. We have group sessions. Like, it's not it's not bad at all. And people who are going to sit there and talk shit about it because I was in a psych ward need to fucking grow up. At least I got the help I needed. Like, for real. It just, oh my god, makes me so mad. Okay, second thing that makes me mad. People are bugging out because the people I date. Okay, first of all, I don't know how it fucking concerns you, okay? My last girlfriend lived in Ohio. I live in New York. That's not that far anyway. Um, my girlfriend I have now, she lives in Michigan. She was over here for this weekend. It's not like I never see her. I see her. Like, oh my god. And when does my relationship have to do with shit with you? Like, if a person makes me happy, then fucking let me be. Like, you have to sit there saying that I can't, I can find people from around where I live. I've dated people from around here. It doesn't work out. I clearly fucking don't like the people from around here, okay? Like, if you have a fucking problem, look at your own relationship before you judge mine. Because last time I checked, you have a new boyfriend every other week. So, you need to fucking, at least the girls I'm with, I'm with them for, like, years. Like, a year and a half, a year. Like, I'm with them for a long period of time. Just pisses me off when people are going to sit there and say shit about stuff they don't even understand or know. Like, oh my god. It just makes me so mad. Um, those are the two main things that we need to vent about. Because I got my nails done today. See? It's... Oh, no. Okay. But anyway. No, it just really pisses me off. Like, oh, my God. I was going to make a status about it, but it would have been a really long status. I'm still going to make a status about it. Plus the video in more detail. So...